The settlement block of Elkanah, Sha'are Tikva and Etz Ephraim is currently populated by over 10,000 Jewish residents. The village of Mes Ha is built on the remains of a settlement that began about 3,000 years ago, and was inhabited throughout history. In the Ottoman period there was a small Muslim village with dozens of inhabitants, and today there are more than 2,000 Muslim residents. The Arab village of Zawiya was an ancient settlement, next to it in Deir Qasis was a Byzantine monastery, in the Ottoman period it was a small village, today there are about 6,000 inhabitants consisting of three main clans. To the north, the village of Sanaria is built on top of an ancient settlement from the Hellenistic period. In the Roman period water pools and storage rooms were carved in it. It had a citadel from the time of the Crusaders, on which the Muslims built a mosque during the rule of the Mamluks and later during the time of the Turks. In a cave next to it skeletons were found, which according to tradition belonged to Muslim warriors who fought with the Crusaders. In the vicinity of the village there are several ruins of ancient citadels and settlements. Today, about 4,000 Muslim residents live in the village. The village of Beit Amin is built on the ruins of an ancient settlement, which began in the Iron Age and where remains from the Persian and Roman periods were found. Azan Atama was a settlement that according to archaeological findings was inhabited for 3,000 years. In the Ottoman period it was a village with hundreds of inhabitants. Today, about 4,000 Muslim residents live in the villages of Beit Amin and Azan Atama. In the 30s, the British paved road 505. Kirbat Sarija was a settlement from the Iron, Roman, and Byzantine periods. In 1977 Elkana was established next to it. Gush Immunum members first tried to settle in the Jordanian police station of Kafar Mesha but were refused by the State of Israel. With the support of Prime Minister Rabin, the settlement was established after its founders returned to settle in the police station. Share Tikva was established in 1985 on a private initiative. They bought land from the village of Azan Atama. After the construction of the settlement began, there was a legal dispute between the developers and the residents. After that, the government helped in its establishment. Etz Ephraim was also established on the lands of the same entrepreneurs and with the approval of the Israeli government. In the first intifada there were several confrontations between the Jews and the Arabs. In the Oslo Agreement, the Arab villages were declared as Area B, which is managed by the Palestinian Authority. Most of the lands of the villages belong to Area C, which is under Israeli control. After the second intifada the separation fence was built, following which there were clashes with the residents of Zawiya and Azan Atama who remained as an enclave. Road 5 crossing Samaria bypassing the settlements was built, replacing Road 505. 